What's going on guys, Kyger here. In today's video, we're going to talk about how you're missing out on millions of gold not doing this before you do your dailies. Let's get into it. Alright guys, so what I'm going to tell you isn't very complicated, but I know a lot of people don't do it. I see a couple people do it on my server, but I know when I bring this up, across all the discord servers i'm on no one realizes even though the game already told you about it and what i'm going to talk about is the hot spring and the biggest problem people have is where to find it and i'm going to show you so here i'm at the castle i'm going to hit the uh, home icon on the top right hand corner of the map and then it's going to take me to the main city of that zone and what's going on here is then we're going to go to Florence, which is where the hot spring is. It's actually a mission that you have to do in Florence as you progress through the story. And how do we get there? There's no like bigger map, uh, big up the map and whatnot. So what you have to do is scroll down. Guild, Merchant, Ascension, Subjugation airship you hit airship and then it takes you uh, to the guy that lets you change zones right over here change continent and then make my way to Florence yes move to Florence and then the actual hot tub, uh, not hot tub hot spring will show up on your bar on the top left so if I scroll down we will see Florence Hot Spring. I hit the Hot Spring, come over here, and you. I'll explain how you guys are missing out on literal millions of gold by not doing this every day. As you see, there's only like two guys here, and they're just hanging out. So Florence Hot Spring. You hit Bath Herb in the bottom right, and it asks you for an herb and let me show you the lowest quality right here so each of them each of the two options is for three hours and it's either experience or gold and once you uh, max out it is really hard to go from 60 to 61 whatnot but that will come over time just by doing your dailies and things like that so I don't recommend going for experience. As you all know, gold is a bottleneck in this game. So I recommend going for gold. But this 2% isn't really much, right? Well, that's on a gray item. If I look at a green, it's 4%. Or a blue, it's 6%. I'm assuming purple would be 8 and orange would be 10 but I don't have those to show you right here and I haven't tested myself I've only been doing sixes uh, so you click here then you click 6% uh, gold energy from the hot spring exit hot spring boost right there and if you click uh, bottom left where my uh, head is it'll pop up right here competent summoner summoner which is a buff that we have from the event and then hunting gold reward buff uh, two hours because it doesn't show the full three because it started the countdown immediately increase gold by six percent and then you just do all your dailies you do all your curios as you see that's about five thousand gold you're probably doing it six to nine times a day that's six 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 and then path of growth you do um, probably two refreshes so six uh, 9, 12, and if you look, 5,400, or <laughs> 9,000, pretty good, or even 4,500, which is decent. And the big bang is going to come in from the rupture assist, because that's 20k plus the normal 75, so that roughly... Uh, 100k right there and then 100k plus six percent so uh that's going to be 
a lot of extra gold and you do that for the sunken ruins and distorted sky island you do it for your raids but i don't believe yeah they don't give gold do, do, do. expeditions are going to be a huge one because you can do this one right here 50 times ideally you would do the highest you can at least level three so you can get these uh, right here and as you see it's only 600 gold but 50 times and then i i personally uh, refresh it once so it's a hundred times uh, you do two a day on these that's another 12k and as you see it's just everything you do you're getting extra gold so i really think this would help you guys get literal millions of gold very very quickly just from doing your dailies you go to the hot spring you hit the hot spring you do a food buff which i uh you should be doing food buffs and then sprint through your dailies you're good and reap the rewards let me know in the comment section down below if you already knew about this and if you're going to start doing it pass it along to your guilds and until next time guys